Greetings, my fellow lovers of tunes, and welcome back to another Mr. Fantastic reaction video here on the channel, where we enjoy the music, of course. Now, we are once again doing a special request by the one and only Mr. Ryan Hansen, so thank you very much for the special request. We did our first ever introduction to Mr. Fantastic in a video before with the Gundam Breaker song absolutely fantastic they sound absolutely incredible it sounded so familiar and i'm very happy that i got to like find out where i heard it from or i think i found where i heard it from but we are doing a second video today called however i have no idea what to expect when we discover a new group or we add it to our lineup it's always so interesting because you get a feel for them you get that first initial reaction but you have no idea what else they are capable of the versatility they have what what other surprises they have in store for us so i'm very excited to see another video of theirs uh so let's just get into it and then we will discuss it afterwards as always to put on the automated captions on that video but i didn't think they wanted to work with us today incredible song i love the i love the rhythm i love the feel the the beat like the tempo of these songs it's so it's so fun and fast but also so relaxing at the same time i don't know how to describe it it reminds me it it gives me that feeling of you are busy with the task we're busy with something and this plays in the background just to take your mind off it or keep your mind focused on it this is the the style of music that i'm getting from this and i think it works so well the lead vocalist has an incredible voice these guys are so talented with the in instruments the the stuff that they have done absolutely phenomenal the gu guitar solos are absolutely insane towards the end there that um that sort of vocalization 
don't know what to call it that he did there at the end reminded me so much of freddie mercury where he did a that day or to the crowds you know that sort of thing it, it reminded me so much of that nice little thing to add to the song to uh just to end that off with the video itself was so like mysterious almost with the dark elements and that orangey light to it that i think it works so for so well for what they wanted it to be absolutely incredible now however i will be honest with this one i found it a little bit more difficult to like understand what it is about maybe because the way i pictured the song didn't really correlate to what the song is about so i went and tried and translated it um the lyrics to see what it is all about and it it, it sounds like it's like a story or from what i've gathered it's like a half human half vampire like i'll read you the first line says uh, I always live by devouring someone else's life. I'm dizzy and hungry for someone, however, clear while hiding yourself. I'm not reading it the way it's supposed to be, but that's basically what it says. And by going through it, it I found it quite interesting because as a if you think about a vampire, you think about the insatiable hunger for blood and uh, consuming and all those things. And I'm wondering if this was, again, a literal thing just about a, a vampire or maybe the the metaphorical sense of it where he compares himself to a vampire not fully human because he doesn't relate to things the same as any other person would do he maybe doesn't process emotions the same that the other person would because in the i don't know if this is the bridge or the chorus it says even love becomes just a tool swaying in such a world however that made me think like if uh, if he describes in such a way that love becomes a tool is it really in the sense of that he doesn't have emotions because vampires have been known in different depictions to be able to switch off emotions or do not have emotions or stuff like that and maybe that's why he compares himself to a half human half vampire like a hybrid between those because he hasn't really come to the full sense of discovering his inner self and what he is about but that might all just be um a story that i just fabricated i have no idea if that is exactly what I, what the song is about i just found it interesting because i couldn't put my finger on exactly what i found from this song but if you look at the look at it that way it feels it feels almost like a confession when he sings the song you know like he's getting it out of his chest and he's sort of putting it out there asking maybe for advice um and admitting to his faults in a sense of a way. but maybe i'm just getting too technical with it regardless it was an amazing song really fun to do and i'm very happy that we get to add another group to our lineup it's been fantastic the these past few requests well 12 to be exact from ryan hansen was absolutely incredible it's been so much fun there's been so many ups and downs so many different emotions so many fun times it's absolutely incredible so thank you very very much for all of these requests your generous donations i really appreciate it more than i can ever say and it's so fun to go through these things discover new things and find music that i've never heard before and it's all thanks to you guys and especially to the people like ryan that sends these requests it's so so much fun so thank you very very much uh but i would love to know from you guys what do you think about this song what do you think about what I just mentioned about like my thoughts on this song. Do you agree? Do you think I'm going, I'm thinking a bit too literal about it or overthinking it maybe? Uh, let me know your thoughts on this below. And yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. I hope you guys are staying safe and healthy out there. Remember to check up on one another and then I'll see you soon in the next video. But until then, remember, music is medicine.